San Francisco is hoping the return to the yellow tier will revitalize one of the, the country's latest or the country's few uh, surviving Japan towns. KTVU's Christian Kafton tells us the COVID-19 pandemic and lockdowns were especially hard on Japantown, but now officials say that community is poised for a comeback. San Francisco's Japantown has stood for more than 100 years, celebrating Japanese food and culture. Grace Hodakiti from the Japantown Community Benefit District says it's a resource worth protecting. It's important to preserve our culture, not only for us that are living here today, but our future generations as well. I mean, it's one of only three Japan towns in the whole United States, so even more so that we must continue to keep this uh, Japan town thriving. As the COVID pandemic spread last year, Japan town was especially vulnerable because of a high concentration of elderly residents. On a regular day before COVID, you'd see all the uh, what, who we call Jichan and Bachans walking down the street with their walkers. But because of COVID, you know, they had to stay home. They, they couldn't go out. Japantown pulled together, protecting the older residents and offering delivery services and COVID testing. The COVID pandemic was also especially hard on Japantown economically because so many of Japantown's small businesses are indoors here inside the Japan Center. The Japantown malls were uh, shut down for about three months, which impacted the merchants considerably. Japantown lost about a dozen shops and small businesses. Grants and loans saved many of those that survived. The neighborhood traditionally also relied on big festivals and cultural events to draw visitors. Now, Japantown boosters say it's a new day. Loosening COVID restrictions means some of those smaller events will return. But it's more important than ever for locals from the city and around the bay to visit culturally significant neighborhoods like Japantown. Any visitor that comes here, they get a sense of all the taste of these different types of cultures, African-American community, Japanese-American community, Chinese, Filipino, you know, it, 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 and it's all within a, a walking distance. The Community Benefit District says Japantown is an important monument to the diversity that makes San Francisco unique. And despite the challenges it has faced over the last year, the area will help fuel the city's overall comeback from the COVID pandemic. It is a community effort to help our small businesses. And if they can survive and thrive, you know, this whole city can survive and thrive. So um, you got to eat local, shop local and support local. In San Francisco, Christian Kafton, KTVU, Fox 2 News.